All right, if you're really into Call of Duty Mobile, for me, this is the best way to play it. Now, I've used the ROG Phone 2, Red Magic 3S, the Huawei Mate 30 Pro, regular phones that don't have triggers on them, but I'm a trigger man. I need the actual feel of playing on the console because I came from playing on consoles. And I know Call of Duty is available on consoles, but you know what? The portability of having an iPad, I could take it anywhere I want easily. I know there's Nintendo Switches and things like that, but having this huge screen with a controller and one I'm familiar with, Remember to do this, you must only use first party Xbox One or PS4 controllers. And then you're good to go. First thing is you have to sync it and make sure it is enabled in the Bluetooth menu. So I got my Xbox wireless controller there. Next thing I do is once I have all that set up, I go into the controls. I keep it with the advanced mode custom layout with the hip fire. And what I do is I pretty much open up my screen or I make the icons as transparent as possible because I don't need them on the screen. I don't need them in my way if I'm using a controller. I like to keep tap and hold so that I can hold it down and that'll enable the aim. So that's the main difference that I use. So while I'm playing, of course I try to go the rank match route and I am not the best, but I like to get down. Sometimes when I want to jump to the game, rank match takes too long. So just for the purpose of this video, I'm going to regular match. I'm going to hit start. And I can jump right into a game just to show you guys what's up. Now you can customize the buttons how you like it. And pretty much they're already set from the get-go. And of course I get a map that I hate. But anyway, check it out. I'm trying to show you the controller. There's my L trigger. Somebody already on our side. Oh, bust it, bust it. Somebody else right here, creep around that corner, bam. Ah, he got me. But that aiming is unparalleled. Are you trying to sneak right here? Got it. You just have so much more control in the comfort of any seat you want in the house. Oh, come slipping. Now, yeah, I'm playing against some bots right now for the purpose of showing y'all what's up, but there are some actual humans out here. But just check out how I still keep, I still keep, uh, I still keep auto sprint on. I think that's just a feature that's, you know, pretty, pretty standard to have. Yes, your foot are louder but I think with this fast paced action like this nobody's even tripping off as much oh somebody's trying to bust on me from behind whoa he got me he got me burn me up but as you can see huge screen now this is the 12.9 inch iPad um, yeah, it's fun playing it on the phones and it is even more portable as you would imagine. But sometimes my hands slip. Sometimes my hands slip. Sometimes my fingers slip off of the triggers or I misplace it with the standard controller. It doesn't happen. Got him. Another tip I have, always aim. Always aim. Oh look, they're all around us, but I got two creeping up behind me. It's time to get my burn on. Check it. They done. Oh! Got a little too excited. Burnt it right there. Literally. 
<laughs> so I've been having so much more fun playing it this way. Sometimes you go hip fire, sometimes it doesn't work. You always tell the boss because they just stand in there pointing at you fire it. But that hasn't taken away from experience. And there it is. So remember it has to be an official first party controller. I'm having a ton of fun playing Call of Duty Mobile. Now controllers aren't enabled for every game, but the ones that are amazing. This game does not run at 90 or 120 frames per second, but it does have that refresh rate and the games that are running at that frame rate, it's a beautiful experience. So if you love gaming and I mean, it's kind of hard to hold this, it's kind of heavy. So the games that you can use control on, I highly recommend. Hey, try it out. Let me know what y'all think. Just don't forget, Cobra told you. And if you want to see me on this game, you saw the name, Cobra Life with a K. All right, till the next one.